All right, what's up guys? Today's video, we are going to be reorganizing the garage. We got Amanda here. Yes. If you guys remember on the last video when we, well, not the last video, but quite a while ago when we washed the Dakota. Um, so we're gonna be putting the Ram SRT10, not there, but here. So the Viper is gonna go there and the Ram SRT10 will go here. Dakota will stay here while we work on it and continue the Pro Charger install. So if you guys haven't seen that last video, go check it out. We started installing the Pro Charger on it. So um, we're gonna put the S2000 outside for now. I know a lot of people are hating on the Honda S2000. So, but just so you guys know, I think I've said it a few times, that car is kind of my autocross and road course car. So it's just kind of a fun toy for me to have. I know not a lot of content on it right now, but we did the full rebuild on that car and then now it just kind of sits there a little bit just as kind of a toy more or less. So anyways, I also have to head over to AutoZone, order some, uh, I'm gonna order a couple brake rotors for the Ram SRT10. Yeah, I probably could spend a ton of money on rotors if I wanted to, but um, actually AutoZone rotors, funny enough, they have a lifetime warranty. So if they warp, I don't really care. But um, yeah, I mean, I'm gonna put the rotors on there. We already replaced the pads. So I got a bunch of stuff I gotta order. Let's go over there and wash up the truck and reorganize the garage and Amanda will help. Let's so work. let's go, let's get to it. Yeah, I think we're gonna take the Ram SRT10 right now. So let's go. Okay, here we go. Ooh. What do you think of this truck? I love it, it's so sporty. It still smells new in here. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's go for a ride, SRT. Oh. Let's start it up. Cold start. Oh, she needs an exhaust, boys. She's too quiet. Let's go. Oh my God, we're stuck in traffic. How do you feel about that? Not good. Not good. <laughs> it's like a five minute drive that turned into an 80 minute drive. No, it wasn't that long. It feels like it. it feels like it. So we're gonna clean up the truck. Hopefully, we're kind of running out of daylight. So we're gonna try and get the auto zone order the brake parts and then come back. I tried ordering them online, but there's some weird thing that I called them um, and they said I couldn't order them because it was a special order item for this truck. Don't know why, <laughs> but that's the situation and I'm gonna order, it's weird, I'm just ordering, and not that you guys really care that much, but I'm just ordering the front rotors through AutoZone because I can't get those online and then right now AutoZone has like a 20% off coupon that I can use online which I'm going to use on the rear rotors and rear pads so that's the plan for now and we'll get the auto zone hopefully in a minute here all right here we are auto zone go get it Just falling asleep here by the way I'm not eating this morning uh, are you guys feeling I think she is yeah dodge <laughs> Yeah, I'll just get the two fronts and then I'll, I'll get the the rears online. So you just want to get these for you? Yeah. Today? Yeah. Hey, you got it. Pretty ten thirty. Okay, appreciate it, man. Thank All right. you. Okay, have a good one. You too. Hey, okay. the receipt. <laughs> Okay, so we're back at the garage and let me show you guys hopefully i can show you guys quick this is the reason why i'm getting new rotors so they're all pitted and even the rears the fronts are completely you can probably see all that pitting and these are warped too so that's why i'm getting new ones and we should have those coming soon okay i might be running out of room to actually wash the truck but i'm gonna do all the whole switcheroo thing viper's gonna go out and then we'll bring the truck back in and then viper on the air side Okay, you guys ready to see an all Mopar garage? You guys asked for it, so we did got it. it. <laughs> did it, got it. So this is what it looks like now. So we got the Viper here and there's actually quite a bit of room. I could actually tuck this in more if I wanted to. And I do have wheel dollies where you could put the vehicle or any vehicle on it and move it over. 
And then here's the Ram SRT10 over here. So I left the back of the truck kind of close to the garage so we could still walk around, get to the you know supercharger components for this and anything else because we got kind of a bunch of stuff on the side here. So I got race cans, jacks, and you know a creeper over there. So all that stuff. And so what? I, like I was telling you guys, I think a few minutes ago, I got to clean up the whole truck. So, but at least I can get it out of the elements so that when we clean it, we can bring it back in and everything's arranged that way. Cause it would kind of be a shame to like clean it and then have to leave it outside still. So I put new pads on, like you guys remember when we rebuilt these calipers. So this has new pads, but the rotors themselves are just shot. So that's that. And then on the back, we're going to go all new. So I need new pads or I can put new pads. I it's actually not bad, but I think just just because I'll put new pads on here as well and we'll get the new rotors on here too and we'll go order that. So we're going to go inside. I'll show you guys that order and that way we get these parts coming. If you guys are trying to save a buck or two right now on AutoZone, they have this deal. So I'm getting both front rotors or sorry, rear rotors. Um, both of them is going to be $95.98, so $48 a piece. And then the rear brake pads are 25 bucks, but then I'm getting 24.19 off for a total of $96 with shipping. So that's almost it for today's video, you guys. We ordered the parts for the Ram SRT10. We got the brakes coming. We're still working on the supercharger project on the RT. I do have some goodies for this that I will show you guys once we get the supercharger set up done on the Dakota. I'll show you guys that. And also, if you guys haven't yet, Amanda's wearing the merch too. Yes. So Take we got Boost Motorsports on the front. Life is too short to keep it stock on the back. Definitely go get yourself one of those down in the description. Hey. You guys can see, you'll see all those, you know, different merch, shirts, uh, sweaters, all that stuff. So it check that out. With everything. Yeah. And we also have the Dakota RT one too. So definitely check that out. Also hit that join button. You guys, we've got a ton of projects and any help is definitely appreciated with getting all these parts and keeping everything moving as well. Hit that subscribe button, hit the like button. See you on the next video. Take care.